So I'm just making more of my skulls, just kind of cranking them out, just like, um, you know, making, making cookies or anything else. Um, you know, I already mentioned that this isn't a really good thing to do on a humid day um, for a few reasons. Um, you know, uh, there's a certain... Um, the mixture does need to be kind of dry in order to mold properly and to unmold properly. You know, you don't want things too sticky and too humid, so it's really best to do this on kind of a dry day. Um, the other thing is, is, you know, these sugar skulls, I mean, look at these that I've made here. They're about an inch and a half thick at their thickest point. And so before I can really decorate them or give them away or use them in kind of a, you know, decorative way, they really need to be dry all the way through. And so that can just take forever during the humid season. I mean, if you, you know, live somewhere that, where it's humid or you're trying to do this on a rainy day, um, it's going to take forever for these things to dry out, and they're just going to crumble and fall apart. So there's a few solutions to that. I mean, if you do live in a humid part of the country and, you know, you are living in an air-conditioned house, um, air conditioning can dry out the air in your house. And if you really are kind of diligent about that, you know, sometimes if you do this indoors with air conditioning, you can get them dry enough. You know, you can get the environment in your house dry enough to, um, for them to dry out. Me, if you look at the reason I'm um, putting them onto a cookie sheet is because I'm going to use the oven to sort of um, kind of speed up the drying process a little bit. And so once I kind of get this uh, kind of cookie sheet filled with enough of these skulls, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set the oven on its lowest setting just which is depending on the oven could be as low as 100 degrees and some, some ovens even go lower than that 80 degrees or something like that and I'm going to keep the oven propped open and I'm just going to use that kind of dry heat in the oven to help facilitate the drying of the sugar skulls and so that can kind of speed it up and get them ready for decorating a lot sooner.